Hey, what's up, stream? Chop, chop, chop. Chop, chop, chop. You can already hear me going. We're just another casual Maple Story stream today. Nothing exciting, nothing not exciting. And we're all ready to go. All right, but we'll just kick it right off. I meant to do a background to my stream, but uh, I uh, didn't. So it wasn't all black, but I didn't. I also forgot to change into my gear, but that's fine. It's changing time. keep on our prepared pendant. I don't care if it takes a little bit longer to kill things. I'd rather the EXP. We're at 60% already. So we'll just go right into... Oh, and we're gonna also kill this AFK mob. We forgot to change our link skills back to our EXP link skills. We'll have to change them back again later, but we'll do our EXP skills and our EXP legion until our friend who wants to do H Lo Mien together, or I want to do them together, and I invited him because I wanted to do it together. But he said he might be a little later on account of him doing other things and having a life. Uh, so we will probably do that a bit later once we get there. But for now, we'll just do a little bit of this, a little bit of that, etc., etc. Do our dailies, possibly pop a WAP, depending. Um, and tomorrow, the big stream is going to be uh, Zelda Tears of the Kingdom, which I'm quite excited to play. Because, uh, yeah, I haven't played it yet. Um, but that will be a bit later in the evening. Um, so just don't worry, you don't have to spend time early in the morning coming here. Oh, I also want to put on my pets. There we go. Because you can't go wrong with the goodies. And we'll just wait for Maple Story to wake up a little bit. It's lagging just a tad. Once we get there, let's install shields back up. Keep on popping. Hey, what's up, Joker? Welcome back, bud. How you been? How's tricks, as the kids say? We're back to the usual, usual daily grind. You know how it is. Just making light. Oh, work was a bit crazy today. Um, I had to stay a bit, about an hour and a bit late. Um, wasn't so bad. Uh, I wasn't doing anything crazy, just some, uh, what's the word for it? Administrative stuff that I needed to get done before I left. So it wasn't bad that I had to stay, like I wasn't staying for trouble. I didn't have a lot to work, just administrative stuff. Um, I think I mentioned I do teaching as part of my job. Like I teach people how to do my job basically, or how to work at the company I work for, uh, and, uh, I had to get their grades input today, and 
wasn't so bad. It just took a long time to finish their sort of test slash assessment that I was grading. It took a while to finish it, so we ended up finishing about 15 minutes before the end of the day. Uh, so then I had to put it, like, the last mark we got in was, like, at 8.45 my time. And then I had to input all the grades into the system. Uh, and they have to be put in sort of individually with, like, an explanation. So it was nothing crazy. It wasn't bad, but just you got to get it done. Especially for me now, it's a long weekend. So I, uh, I had to get it done before the long weekend. Because I would definitely either forget by Monday or uh, somebody might be upset if I don't get it in by Monday. But we got her done. And I'm excited for tomorrow. Gonna play Tears of the Kingdom, the new Zelda game. I think I got it all set up and working now. Oh yeah, exactly. I'm gonna stream Tears of the Kingdom for probably quite a while tomorrow night. Um, and then Sunday, I'm, I'm gonna stick to Valheim on Sunday because I love Valheim and I never tired of Valheim. Um, so I'm gonna do that. Uh, and probably some more Tears of the Kingdom uh, throughout the... Uh, throughout the week at some point, I would guess, depending how fun it is. Um, maybe I'll hate it. Maybe I'll love it. Who knows? I haven't played it, and I've avoided all the spoilers. <laughs> um, and then Monday is going to be up in the air, because, again, Monday is my day off for my long weekend, so I could... I might do more Maple Story, like a big Maple Story grind day. Um, I might just take it off just for myself. Or if Terrace of the Kingdom was really fun, uh, I'll play more Terrace of the Kingdom. Because, you know, if it's fun, I'll do it. I'm here for fun, man. I'm always about. But yeah, the stream will start later tomorrow as well. Um, I, just ha I have daytime stuff I gotta do. It's the one downside I find to working later into the night and later into the evening. While it definitely fits my sleep schedule, like I'm a late night, early, or late to go to bed, late to, uh, et cetera, et cetera. Oh, what are you getting her? She's not going to agree with it. Get her a debate. That's what you should get her. Then she's always going to disagree with it. Because that's what debates are. They're just giant... Let's disagree with each other. The greats are debates are the ultimate paradox. Oh, it's just an expensive gift. She might think it's too much. Fair enough. I've been there. I don't want to spend good money on somebody you like. That's fine. I uh, again. For me, I'm always like you know, if I like it, like if I'm like I think you'll like it, then spending money for me as long as you know it's money that i can be spending right like never spend your bill money uh if you pay bills never spend the money you have for bills on gifts but you know if it's money you want to spend on somebody it's money well spent it's always how i think of it right and some people disagree but Okay, Xbox Live card. Hey, yeah, that's something. Assuming she's a gamer, an Xbox gamer. Would be a, a terrible gift if she, you know, didn't play Xbox, probably. Um, but I'm assuming she plays Xbox. Uh... <laughs> Xbox Windows Xbox Live, yeah. Figured as much. Yeah. Would be a very funny gift to get somebody who doesn't have an Xbox and has showed no interest in Xbox. The ultimate gag gift. One that's useless. But no, that's not a bad gift if she likes playing Xbox. Uh, 
Let's go. Here we go. Uh, assassins. Bop. And we're almost out of our good area in this game, so we'll have to go to our new area for level grinding. It'll be a salute to 1-4. My favorite Meso map. But it's fine. It also means we're that much closer to uh, completing our goals. But I'm also... I was hoping... Or I'm going to. I was promising myself I would, but I've been slacking. I need to put in more grinding time on MapleStory. Even though there are games like Terrors of the Kingdom that I want to play, I want to hit 275 before mid-June-ish. Um, so I got to get on the MapleStory grind a bit harder than I have been. I've been slacking a bit this week. Um, I've been slacking a bit this week on streaming, too. Yeah, and a year. And I mean, Xbox Live. I know it's expensive, but that's not like... It's not like $600. Like, for me, like, anything over, like, $400 is an expensive gift. Like, but what is it? Like, $120? Like, 12 or at least it used to be like 12 bucks a month if it's one year. So that'd be what? 12 turns out 150 bucks? For me, that's like... And I mean, that's going to obviously depend on your financial situations and all that sort of stuff. But, like, that's, you know... Oh, 60 plus X. Oh, even easier. Well, that's also... I'm also thinking of it in Canadian dollars, so I don't know. I don't know the exchange. That's probably like our... Oh, would that be Canadian? It's like you guys are every dollar of your your guys' money is like a dollar eighteen of ours, so probably like seventy dollars Canadian plus tax. But we also have higher taxes too, and better healthcare. Ha <laughs> ha! Go Canada. Uh, but. Uh, All this mesos I wasn't picking up. We do. We absolutely do. Pretty much everywhere that's <laughs> that's not like a poverty-stricken, like, hamlet in the middle of nowhere has better <laughs> health care than the United States. <laughs> Basically everywhere. If you have any sort of development to your country, it's better than the U.S. health care system. <laughs> But for that, of course, we pay higher taxes. But what I don't get, and I've never been, but apparently, and it's a North American thing, and it's on what you said about like it being $60 plus tax. In like the UK, in all of Europe, they don't sell things plus tax. Like, it's not like, you know, like, oh, that this item is $40 plus tax. It, it's all calculated with the tax included. Um, which just makes sense to me. It's like, you're going to be charged the tax anyway. Why is it not calculated on, like, the list price for something? Like, it doesn't make sense to me why it wouldn't be on the list price. And, like, yeah, it's like, why is it always, like, a mystery? Like, in my head, I, I pick something up and I'm like, having to figure out, like, in my head, okay, what, what is it with, like, you know, 13% like tax or whatever our taxes are for provincial and uh, federal here. It's like, oh, now you gotta figure out. It's like, it's a mystery. Um, it's like, you could just tell me what the price is. It's like, you're going to pay, you know, $4.23. Like, that's how much of this costs, taxes included. Like, I don't get why we don't 
just put tax on like we know what the taxes are <laughs> like i don't know why we don't put like we don't include taxes it doesn't make sense to me and like i can you know what and i can give a pass to like online services like something like xbox live i can give a pass why that's plus tax because taxes are different like state to state province to province uh kind of thing like there's federal and then there is provincial or state taxes so i can understand for like each state having like for online services where you don't know for sure what the taxes are going to be because like anyone from any place can buy it like i understand then but when it comes to like items in a store like taxes should be included Perfect, yeah. And again, hopefully she likes it. I'm sure she'll appreciate it. I think in general, people have like a desire to be modest about gifts they get. Um, but I think it deep down, like, you know, if the gift is thoughtful and it's like, yeah, th this person thought I would like this and so they got it for me. Like, I think people are always appreciative of gift getting gifts. Like they might be like, oh no, you shouldn't have or whatever, but it's like, no, they like they're happy. People are happy to get gifts as long as it's not a crappy gift. Probably a plushie of sorts. I recently saw a plushie that I wanted, but oh, that's completely changing. I was I was looking for Cacnea plushies, but I uh, I did get the other day. I was just uh, breeding up a Cacnea to be ready to. Uh, I was gonna hatch on stream for a shiny. Ca Cacnea, like three eggs in, I got my shiny Cacnea. So now I have a shiny Cacnea, and I'm very pleased about it. So I'm also taking a bit of a break from Pokemon uh, because of that, because there are no more shinies I need or want yet. I'm sure that'll change once. Uh, from Shin Shin, or from Shin Megami Tensei. Never heard of it. Or actually, I, it sounds like something I have heard of, but probably wiped from my memory. Um, but I was very pleased about my gettings, goings on with... Uh, with Pokemon. I've, uh, I'm like, I had, I had a good stopping point until the DLC releases. And then I'll get the DLC. Okay. Yeah, that's probably where I know it from. I've probably heard someone, again, my, my little brother's a big Persona fan. So he's probably mentioned it. Uh, it was in my memory files. I'm like, that sounds familiar. But... Uh, not familiar enough that I'd be like, that's what that is. Uh, speaking of anime series, though, Jack Ross the mascot. Fair enough. Um, have you ever watched Black Clover? Given any watch to Black Clover? If not, it's fine, but... Uh, it's just at work today. I uh, was referencing Black Clover. It's a pretty good one. Um, the main character is pretty unlikable, but uh, overall it's a good series. Like, the pacing is great, the uh, story is great, all that. Um, but today, as part of the uh, assessment I was telling you about for my uh, people I'm training, uh, I had to pretend to be a person in need of roadside assistance. Uh, so, you know, I had to pretend and they had to help me with my roadside assistance, which is what the job they'll be doing is. Um, and so I was, uh, for each of them, I was one of the different uh, ten captains from uh, the Magic Knights uh, from Black Clover. And it was very fun. 
and they were all like all the people I'm training are like old old people like in their 60s so nobody got it which made me even happier because it's very funny to you make references and then nobody gets them and then you can just sort of have that chuckle to yourself at least that's funny to me all right i also got to check discord real quick uh 20 minutes all right I just gotta keep an eye out. My friend and I are bossing. I'm gonna stay on stream, but my friend and I are bossing in about 10 minutes. He didn't at me in Discord. He just messaged. So I didn't get the link. But we'll be going nuts. Going nuts and kicking butts. I also should design a new backdrop. I keep saying that, but like, I don't like the just black backdrop uh, behind it. I just want to make like, just like a desert, like a, a pixel desert. Like not even, not anything fancy, just not all black is the hope. I was gonna make one yesterday as I was trying to figure out my capture card, um, but then I was just like, eh too lazy and then i had bossing at like midnight and i was like eh i'll do it another day like tomorrow i will probably not do it i'll say i'll do it but i won't do it tomorrow because tomorrow i'm probably going to get after my daytime stuff i'm going to get sucked into tears of the kingdom and assuming it's a fun game i will probably play it late 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 into the night or early morning Well, let's see if we can find a map just to grind on until our friend asks us. So how much did I spend all my points or do I have all my points still? 1528, perfect. So I also, I'll show it in town because it's easier. So I only have about three weeks before I got it. Because I need to have this. Um, I need to have this Magnificent Potion on me in order to hit 275. Like, to make it a big stream, I can hit 275 without it. But, you know, I want to make it a bit of a party. Um... So when I'm at level 274 and like 95%, this will give me the last 5%. Um, but I get that in 7, 14, 15, 16, 17 days. So I got to hit 274 in 17 days at most. Because this I just get like daily stamps for. Like this is just for being signed in. So if I can hit 274 within the next uh, 17 days, like anywhere in between the next 17 days. Um, that's what else I wanted to do. Then I'll be happy. Then I'll be where I need to be. My inventory sorting is also off the rails. I need to sort this better and soon. So how many do I have? How much do I have? Perfect. Yes, that's how much I want. And this guy. Here's for the we're here for berserk tonight. I'm feeling it. I'm feeling spicy about the berserk tonight. And it'll replace the one that I blew up. Uh 
hopefully. I don't think I'll have nearly enough meso to get close to blowing it up. Hey, oh, free map. Somebody was just here, but you move, you lose. Here we go. We'll just be here for like 10 minutes, so I'm not going to pop any potions or coupons or anything. This is just a casualty until our friend arrives. And we'll hit 61% in just a couple of moments. I should probably also start adding Monster Park Extreme, which is the good dungeon to my daily list. It doesn't take long if you have somebody to go. Or some buddies to go with, and I do. So there's no excuse really for me not doing it, aside from laziness and not wanting to do it. <laughs> pop him. Pop, pop. Uh, remember Pop Pop from Community? Is it Magnitude, the one-man party? That guy's also a great singer. I forget the actor's name, but uh, I think he was in, uh, was it Gallivant? But he was pretty good. He's always pretty good. Discord on the phone. Ten twenty-four to ten thirty-four. He should be available. It's like five minutes. Five minutes, the perfect amount of time. We'll just keep popping off. But we'll get to... We'll get to probably... I'm gonna try... If I can tonight, I might only stream one WAP after Lotus and Damien. Um, but then I'm probably going to do another one or two off stream. If I can. If I can only do one more after stream, I might just get too exhausted or too uh, sore. But that'll put us to like 70%. I think that's a good stopping point. 10%. I'm gonna have to make more than 10% a day, of course, to uh, get to 274, uh, or to 274 and 95%. But uh, I will say, I mean, I'll be making 7 or 8% a WAP uh, once I leave here. So 10% here is a lot of time, a lot of grinding, but uh, we'll spend more time later. I also just want to go back to watching Black Clover, because it's a great show. 
just catch up on it, the usual. And I apologize if you can't hear the roommate. He's celebrating. It's also a long weekend for him. But it's totally fine. That's what happens when you live with people. Plus, we're just chilling. Even if he's not here in exactly 20 minutes, we're running without him. I'm kidding, of course, but... Uh... I also have buddy notifications turned off, which I, uh, I have to keep them turned off because I don't want people seeing the IRL names of my buddy lists. Not that I think people would harass them, but, you know, it's always safer. And if I inspire anyone to try this game or play this game, you know, I don't want them adding my friends and being like, Hey, what's up? And then my friends being like, what, what, the, who are you? I forget who it was, but somebody the other night asked if I was a VTuber. Which, again, I don't know how that's like a thing. Watch this, watch this. Now I'm remembering. I'm remembering. Compose tweet. Oh, ho, ho. next level streaming now. I'm composing a tweet. To make sure that people know that I'm streaming. Going uh, live in. Hashtag Maple Story. while we're here. Come hang out and watch me boss slash grind. That's right. We all love a game you can grind and tweet about at the same time. TV slash spiky underscore shield tweet well bam that's how a pro does it tweeting in the middle of the stream while you're grinding
I've also been considering doing the, uh, doing an actual YouTube channel. Um, I have some content ideas for it that I want to enact. That's part of what I'm doing tomorrow is prepping for that content. It's going to probably be very different from what I do while I'm streaming, uh, sort of by design. Um, as much as like, you know, it's like keep your content consistent. Um, you know, I want some of my content to have some variation. Um, and I don't think there's a problem with that. Or I don't have a problem with it. And anyone who does, doesn't have to be here. This is a no obligation channel. Keep on popping them. I should be chosen for voice acting. Not because I'm good at it, but because I want to. Just like a celebrity. Not that I'm a celebrity, but I'm about as talented as a Hollywood celebrity who tries to be a voice actor. They're just like, use your regular voice. I'm just I'm like, okay. As if voice actors don't actually exist. That's what I hate. It's going to be another thing I uh, harp on. I was thinking too about strikes and unions and that sort of stuff. It's all part of the content that I want to sort of start making. I want to do a bit more political rants. It goes back to what uh, came up on stream the other, like mid last week or whatever, about cancel culture. I want to do a whole big. Thing about that just rant about stuff and stuff that I and like you see all these youtubers who go in and like being like I'm the expert listen to me it's like I don't want to do that I just want to rant about stuff how I feel about it and let people you know people can do whatever they want with that information they can take it as they will. Oh, hang on. Up. Oh, my stupid sticky note won't let me write. Oh, well. I'll jot it down another time. Oh, is that just a stone? 
I don't have any arcane droplet stones. Which is silly. They should give me... They should just give me things, I think. I'm not given enough things. I deserve them too. I'm such a horrible person. I deserve good things. I actively make the world worse and nobody gives me things. Ridiculous. Exploded. Everyone's dying. Friend's still not ready for, uh, still not ready for bossing, Lucy. Or at least he has not messaged me on Discord. Let me see if he's on the Discord, like in the chat. He's not. That's fine. I'm in no rush. But the uh, downside I was finding the other night, I uh, did a battle analysis, a three minute battle analysis for uh, versus Hilla. And there's a problem with my battle analysis that I was not really accounting for as a Mihail. Um, and that's the inaccuracy that the battle analysis, like the way battle analysis is, this is Battle analyses, battle analyses, battle analysis, this is, whatever it is, the way they're done, uh, it doesn't work the same for Mihail. Um, especially if you're an endgame Mihail or if you just know Mihail gameplay, um, your big thing is Royal Guard. It's one of your biggest, strongest attacks. Um, so one of the things you want as your inner ability is cooldown skip, which I have 17% out of it. Like it's maxed at 20. So I have 17%. That's pretty good. Um, and it really, really comes into play when you're doing, a, uh, like bossing, you can abuse the iframes, but you can also do a lot more damage. Um, the downside is that in the battle analysis, the statue does touch damage, whereas most late game bosses do not do touch damage. Uh, like versus Hilla, for example, does not do touch damage. I was testing that the other day. Um, and as such, I can do a battle analysis. So my battle analysis against versus Hilla is uh, 83 bill a second. Um, Cause you know, 17% of the time I'm double hit I'm double tapping Royal Guard um, be it while I'm still in my uh, roars effect uh, or just in general I, I just have far more chances to tap Royal Guard um, which almost acts like obviously it's always a chance but it acts as almost a arguably a 20% damage increase that I don't have which especially in endgame bossing that's a lot of difference um, so I, it looks like I have a fantastic BA, but my actual damage I'm capable of putting out is going to be far less, uh, because you can't do, you can't do touch damage and not all your Royal Guards 
against versus Hilla are going to be for damage. You are going to want to use some for the iframe specifically. So it, it can be a bit tricky um, to say what my battle analysis is. The uh, the forty second, you know, that one, fine. Um, I'll take that. I'll, I'll get one or two in. So the forty second battle analysis. Um, is fine, but my three-minute BA uh, is just so skewed by Royal Guard activation uh, due to touch damage. I don't know. We'll do versus Hilla soon. I haven't uh, I haven't done nearly enough practice uh, to confidently do it on stream. I may do it non-confidently on stream, um, but especially if I'm going to be running it with people. Um, listening to them in in voice chat i probably won't do it on stream oh excuse me I had to yawn there um not only because i want them to you know do the call outs and then we can all be sort of on the same page um but yeah i don't know i i just i, I probably won't do it at least our first couple of runs we have a party we're sort of trying to build i probably won't run until we've at least cleared it once as a party or practiced it once or practiced it a few times as a party and then going for the clear um it also might be a bit easier to practice in a party i've been trying to practice alone but it's just it's not working out Partially because I like the damage I have. Uh, according to again, according to like Reddit and that sort of stuff, 83 bill a second is enough to solo uh, hard versus Hilla. But because of the skewed uh, battle analysis for Mihail, um, I likely don't have the damage to solo. And if I do, it'd be like a 30 minute run. Um, and I'm just i simply will not do a 30 minute run the only boss that i'm willing to take like a 30 minute run at uh would be like black knight and hard damien but that's just because hard damien is kind of it's just kind of necessary because of his stupid mechanics I also should get a bunch of uh, mules into uh, Absolab gear in case I make them uh, bossing mules because they're not going to be able to do 5% damage whenever uh, that patch comes out. So I really should start putting them in it now, but I also don't want to level them up. Yeah, well, if I miss out and have to power up my my mules before I can get them into bossing gear, who cares? Certainly not me. Where is this fellow? Give it like five more minutes and see if he's there. Uh, not that we're in too much of a rush, but uh, if he's waiting for me to say I'm ready to, because I can't see my buddy chat. Yeah, just at him real quick. That was a question. Um, it's ready with the question mark. Mm -hmm. So 
sorry. Got distracted by my at. Gotta at people these days for them to take you seriously. But that's all there is to it. And then, if we keep playing Maple Story, which we might, um, once we hit 275, but we'll play it much more casually. Um,. I don't know what I'll do with my life. Although I might keep pushing, depending how much pain there is between 275 and uh, 276. I might keep pushing just to push myself up the Mihaya leaderboards um, and maybe start pushing for liberation. I haven't even, like again, it's only recently crossed my mind to uh, Go ahead. Oh, he's logging in now. Oh, yeah. You you do you. Um, I was here. Uh, I, don't, I don't know if I told you, because I didn't stream last night. Uh, I did stream on Wednesday. Uh, very interestingly, you won't, won't see that stream on my uh, channel. Reason being that uh, I streamed for... Oh two hours or so. I, I streamed a WAP, so a little over two hours, probably about two and a half hours. Uh, only to then realize that I never hit go live. Uh, and I got super uh, annoyed with myself and was like, well, it is what it is. That's my guy there. I like, And I thought I had clicked it. It just, I started streaming and I was just talking to myself for like two and a little bit hours being like yeah here I am streaming blah 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 blah, hanging out you know sort of talk to yourself as you do kind of stuff I'm gonna go into the guild chat I gotta be careful in guild chat because it is because uh... yeah. our guild can be a little bit yeah I'm, uh, wow, look, Excel's got some folks here. Uh, Guild Chat can be... Yeah, exactly. But here we go. We're going to get best in slot gear today. I can feel it. Channel 3 it is. I'm just gonna let him know I am streaming. Just in case he's like, hey, stop streaming. I don't wanna be on your damn stream. There we go. He's ready. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> DM is saying what's up to the stream. We love Yam. Best of the best. Cream of the crop, as it were.
Alrighty, let's set our legion links. Just setting legion slash links. And then I'll be ready to go. Alright. Alright, here we go. Ready for the tough one. Oh, a card game. There's a lot of that going around. I know we were talking the other night about, like, shows turning into comics, comics turning into shows. But there's a lot of, like, blank turning into uh, card games as well. Like, there's a lot of card game versions of things nowadays. Oh, let's do our... All right, let's use Tengu. And we'll use, uh, where's the guild buff? Then we'll use guild skills. Oh, and red and green potion. All right, and here we go. Hard mode. And I apologize if I don't read chat for a minute. Uh, this is one of the harder bosses in game. So, you know, don't want to lose and all that sort of stuff. If only I could read fluently in Japanese. Yeah, that would be a language that I feel like for the amount of anime I watch and stuff, that that would be a, a good language for me to learn as well. I'd love to learn Mandarin uh, as well, just because there's a lot of Mandarin speaking people in Canada. There's a big Mandarin sort of community. I don't know if community is the right word, but yeah, community is the right word. Just Mandarin speaking people. Oh, platforms. I did not see that. Sorry, it's what happens sometimes. I don't want to get too distracted. One life down. Can't go wrong. Can't mess up. Not live on stream. No messes up. Here we go. Keep him pinned right here. Oh, I'm still under iron body or whatever. Oh, he's, I thought he phased, but he did not phase. I will not yield. There we go. We're only both down one life. We're so far so good. Uh, do I cook with oil a lot? Um, honestly, this sounds weird. I f don't fry a lot. Um, but I'll cook chicken in a pan fairly often. Um, in which case then I'll, like, you need olive oil for it to not stick to the pan. Um, but other than that, like, I don't cook in oil a lot. Oh. <laughs> Both dead. <laughs> he had our number on that one. Just 
wait for Yam to bind him. Found. Disposal of cooking uh, oil or oils and grease in general a le lot easier. I find uh, disposing of like bacon grease uh, much more difficult because I'll usually like all the oil I cook in is usually absorbed into the food because I don't cook in a lot of oil uh, when I do cook in oil. But when it comes to like uh, bacon or something that leaves behind a lot of grease, that's what I'm always like, oh, I have a hard time getting rid of this. Yeah, I apologize. I, I am trying to read chat, but uh, as I said, this is one of the hardest bosses in the game, so. I am trying, needing to concentrate a little bit more in game. I don't want to get too distracted with only two lives left. One life for Yam. It's fine if we don't clear, though. It's only, uh... If we get three tries a day, it'll just be a 30-minute cooldown. Keep each other alive. Oh, yeah, might be dead. I might be dead. No, I'm fine. popping. Your 10 seconds is my right now. Ah, oh, goodness. Ah, uh, darn it. Oh, well. Wasted our burst a little bit. Got a majority of the damage there. It's okay, we'll just keep on cooking him, and he's fine. Um, you heal worst class? Uh, only if you're a bad gamer, I would say. What's up, Heroes Creed? <laughs> Welcome aboard, my friend. I love Mihail. That's why I mean it, of course. You know, it's the best class, and I hope I play it forever. Jet. Uh, 
Oh yeah, yeah, definitely bad gamers. Thanks for the follow as well. Oh, that was not what I thought it was. I messed up. I goofed it. But we're all good. I feel like everyone says worst class about their class. But you can't go wrong with me, Hyle. You really can't. Come on, go after me instead of Yam. Thank you. What do you think, uh, being a 278? Obviously, you were playing, the, uh, or I would guess you played uh, pre-ignition. What are your thoughts on the uh, changes since ignition? I felt it didn't change all that much. It just got a, a, some much-needed sort of TLC. Not like a dramatic change. Yeah. Back in the bad days, back when it was bad. Oh, uh, what are we thinking? We're thinking we're hitting Berserk. Play a Gale products that can be order off the Amazon no strip, solidified food. Slow food. Yeah, I've heard of products like that as well, Joker. Um, like just solidifies grease and you can just either toss it or uh, use it, reuse it. I also hear like you strain it, that sort of stuff. But yeah, Heroes Creed, the damage boost is, like, it's just nice to have a class that can do damage, uh, finally. That's what uh, Mihai was lacking for sure. Uh, this one. Alright, we're at... What am I missing? Oh, that's what I'm missing. Let's see dirt, some Zerk tonight. Easy as pie. Uh, no Zerk tonight. Not this time. Not going to get lucky two weeks in a row. That's fine. It's what happens. Then right to Damien. But I was talking, and I and I want to know your uh, thoughts on it. If you've done a BA, uh, Heroes Creed, uh, the Mihail BA is so stacked. I was saying, like I was I was ranting a bit, like Mihail's BA is so stacked, like incorrectly, because you can just sit on the statue and proc Royal Guard over and over and over on the statue's touch damage. No more than six bucks. Yeah. I've again I've heard of products like that too. Um and they're usually pretty good quality. Like I, I don't know what it is, but there's probably like a singular like non propriety chemical that like uh that they use. Uh I would guess. Pop these at least. Did he just V? I didn't see. Alright, he did. We're V. Very ready, as the kids say. Where he be? Yeah, I don't usually do a BA. I'll do a BA like three times a year typically. Um, but I had to do one because I'm trying to join a versus Hilla party and they wouldn't accept me without a proper BA. So I was like, fine, I'll do it. 
And they made me do a three minute BA, which I was like, ugh, even more annoying. Just keep it in while he's here. Stay in the roar while we can. There we go. Untouchable. Yeah, we're pushing for 275, uh, slowly, surely, but also very, very slowly right now, because it's our last level that we can, uh, get essentially full meso rates at, uh, 1-4, which I find is the best place to get mesos as a Mihail. Um, and I don't feel like making a new meso mule. Like, just, I don't feel like spending the mesos to make a new meso mule. So it's our last level we can raise there. So I've been raising ever so slowly there. Um, but I'll have to switch to Grandis soon. Um, for uh, 273 onwards. Which will be a day very soon, unfortunately. But not the worst. Being able to raise at a reasonable pace. Oh, I'm sure there are. I'm sure there are, Joker. Like, uh... Every game now, or every, like, even if it's not a full franchise yet, which Persona slash uh, Shin Megami Tensei is, um, like, even if it's not a full franchise yet, it's just, like, it's got the niche people that love it. Everything nowadays has its mobile game. It's got its... Uh, you know, it's manga series, it's got its graphic novel, somebody at Netflix is at least talking about making it into a TV show. Um, it's everything has to be available in every form of medium these days, it feels like. Which is, again, I'm not saying that's criticism, I'm just I'm stating that as an observation. There's just, it's like every single franchise, it's like, and I mean, I was about to, no, you know what, I retract what I didn't say. Um, what I was going to say is, like, I feel like TV isn't coming up with its own ideas, but it's, like, really they haven't for a long time. Like, TVs have all, TV and movies and stuff have always been based off of, like, books and shows and stuff. I just wish they, wish they picked new books and shows and stuff, you know? It's, like, uh, like, I, I hate remakes. It's, like, just make something new like i don't care if it's new like a book that just hasn't been done before just don't make the same stuff again like i don't like if it, the new harry potter series like annoys me the new uh lord of the rings annoys me because like those are not old enough to require remakes like they aren't at the point where it's like okay yeah this is outdated it's like they're still well within like I don't know. I just, I dislike it. It displeases me. And of course, all media is supposed to be geared towards me and my tastes alone. Um, which I don't know why people don't seem to get that memo that uh, I am the one whom TV is made for. Um, but they keep not making it for me for, for some reason. Oh, I, oh, I didn't think I would survive that. No, oh, leave me alone, stupid sword. No, I was going to clear my stacks. Where are you? Monster. My stacks. Of course, now it's going for Diami. Oh, it'll come here eventually. Uh, again, like, it's one of those things. It's like, now everything needs everything. If there's money to be made on it, like, somebody's going to be moving it over here. 
Don't you worry. It's not a matter of if, it's just a matter of when. At least that's my, uh, my observation. Of course, the, uh, only observation in the world that matters. But yeah, everything's gonna be, uh, everything comes over, or goes over there eventually. It's all just one big circle of things going back and forth. People are like, we haven't made money off of this yet. And if they don't make money off of it, they'll just re-release it as a new game. Like a new studio will be like, hey, this didn't make any money. We'll re-release it and say it's something new. But it'll be the exact same. Now, yeah. there we go. Thought he could duke me. All right. Yeah, that's what you get. But I do, I'm so happy that I rolled 17% on my eye. This, it was just this past uh, event that I uh, rolled 17%. I'm so happy about it. Like I was sitting at 9% for so long for cooldown skip. Uh, and that extra, almost, uh, that extra 8% is just like, it fuels me. Just being able to abuse the uh, the iframes, just abuse Royal Guard over and over again. It's so great. Pass uh, so other cyborgs from Sega. Only put out games in your tent. I would complain. Oh, yeah. Like, I'm sure that, like, again, for me, just about everything comes over nowadays. Like, back in the days, you used to get, like, this game's only available in Japan. This game's only available. You really don't get that. Like, you'll get, you might miss some goodies, like, you know, a limited time plushie or stuff like that. But you really don't get any, like, this will never be released here kind of stuff anymore. Oh, yeah, I, I gathered that. But like, yeah, you won't get, like, a, like, they'll, whatever they make, like, it's going to be over here. Even if they make it there first, it's going to come over here at some point. Right, there he is. He's not doing his, uh... Uh, up in the air, the balls attack. He usually does it like seven million times. Oops. Whoops, I'm dead. Don't kill me! Come on, Royal Guard! Come on, Royal Guard! Wow, I didn't even need to Royal Guard. I was just very lucky. <laughs> I'm here for that. I'm here to just be lucky. him in a second. Uh, where is he? I guess uh, I am Not the one b bursting first. It's okay. We fell out of our order. Oh, 
I'm totally royal guard. I need to cleanse. Where's my cleanserizer? Cleansed. Before it was too late at that. Zap. Yeah, exactly. And that's usually how it goes. Um, they'll usually release a version in uh, in Japan first. Um, it's the same. It's how uh, Maple Story does it too. Uh, the updates go out because Nexon, the company that makes Maple Story and sort of operates it, they're a Korean company. Um, and all the updates that uh, happen in Korea, we eventually get. But. Uh, no, dead. Oh, not dead. Um, but they just get it first. So all the goodies, all the updates, we get to see it and be like, oh, I can't wait till we get that. Uh, it just takes a while for us to actually get that, whatever it may be. Oh, stupid giant blue balls. Nobody likes you. Get knocked down, fool. Three percent. He's essentially dead. And I just almost killed myself for no reason. Okay, all of you stay on him while I distract. Yeah, that's right. All right, I patch for uh, Yam. It's his turn. I was, you know what? It wasn't a day for Berserk because Yam doesn't have his eye patch yet, so that's why we didn't get one. Here we go, here we go. Uh, no luck. Unfortunate. Next week, faux show. Gonna stream in here. Alright. We'll say adios to Yamsky, uh, fellow beyond fellows, top notch, the toppest of notches of people. We love that guy. Um, 
but now I'll catch up on chat a bit. Uh, companies like Sony make this. Yeah, I really hope that we see just a general return of disc games. Um, like they've just been like games have just been slowly more and more be moving to digital only, um, which I dislike. I prefer physical medium be like even if I purchase it digitally, digitally, I prefer a game be available be available on a physical medium. Wow, my words are coming out so fancy. Yeah. Exactly, and that's the thing. Um, I guess I mean I was about to say that that's always has how it was. It's like, no, you used to have memory cards, but having a physical thing that could move your data around um, was like top tier. And like, obviously, you can do memory, like you can do like move your switch data onto a micro USB or something like that, or you can move it from. Like there are ways to get it. Like there, and there are obviously there's always going to be people who have like adapters. No, Ma Maple Story's always only been online though. There's no like physical download for it. But that's the same with a lot of MMORPGs, I think in general. But I'm talking just like general games. You don't get a lot of. Uh, you don't have a lot of like physical media anymore. And I mean, I get the convenience of, like, because most people will go, like, this is just more convenient to buy a digital version. But at the same time, I, I don't want to see a loss of physical media. And I'm an offender. Like, don't get me wrong. It's not like I'm like, oh, yeah, I always and only buy physical media. Like, I bought Terrors of the Kingdom. And uh, I, uh, I'm looking forward to play it, playing it, but I bought a bit digital version. Um, cause it's just easier than having to go to like a place to purchase a thing. And you can't, and if you order a physical version online though, there's always like, there's like, oh, we're going to charge you extra for shipping it. And it's like, okay, well, I don't want to physically go to the place. I just want the physical medium, which of course you're asking for, oh, I totally regarded <laughs> that, but I guess not game disagreed. What's up, Magnus? Too easy. We don't need all the goodies, but we may as well pick them up. We have nothing to cube, so the cubes are kind of worthless. But hey, they're still there. We'll let them expire in the inventory, and then we'll think last minute, hey, I could have used it on this, but then we won't. Because that's how I play the game. Oh yeah, Maple Story is 100% free. Um, it's free from Steam, or you can download it free off of the website. Um, there is, I'll, I'll tell you, so I play on Reboot. Um, it's one of the servers. There are, I think, seven servers. Reboot's a unique server if you've ever played a MMORPG, because um, there's no trade. You cannot trade, like, you cannot put... Uh, like you cannot trade with other players you cannot trade within your own characters with a little asterisk um, so there really isn't a huge leg up for legacy players like people like me I the only advantage I have is having played an ungodly amount of hours in Maple Story um, but I can't like if I made a new character on my account i can't just like unlike most mmorpgs which obviously allow trade um i could just like oh i'm gonna make a new character grind out all the goodies on my powerful character and just give all the goodies to my like beginning character in the reboot server you can't do that there are other other servers and the other servers you can do that um, and i feel also the other servers like there is a pay aspect obviously it's not totally free um playing the game is totally free in maple story that's true 
Um, any aesthetic stuff, like my current armor set is all, like I paid for it. Like you can buy aesthetic stuff uh, in Reboot. Um, so if you want to make yourself look pretty, uh, fashion story they call it, um, or some people call it, if you want to make yourself look pretty, uh, you got to pay monies, like real IRL monies. Um, but everything like functionally on the Reboot server, uh, you don't have to pay any money. You can do it completely and totally free. Oh yeah, exactly. Fat fashion uh, is is really all it is. Aesthetics in the uh, in the reboot server, you have to pay for. Um, in the uh, actual servers, like in the non reboot servers, you can use money to pay for some progression as well. Uh, but in Reboot, you cannot pay for any progression. Um, all progression is just grinding. Like, there's no... Like, whatever it is, you earned it, right? Even if you got, like, you know, you got something from a boss because, like, a more powerful person took you, you still have to get the stuff. Like, you have to go get the stuff. Um, and you have to get to, like, the right levels to be able to get the stuff. And it's all done through grinding. Oh yeah, as it is weaker than other classes, but uh, I mean, coming up, I think in if you're interested and looking for something to occupy your time in the summer, uh, I think probably mid July they are uh, is is when they're doing uh, their next big update, uh, and the Phantom is one of the classes that's getting a revamp uh, with, so it'll get a lot more power. Um, from what I understand, it'll get a lot of boosts. Yeah, if you get your laptop, uh, I mean, MapleStory ran on my laptop from 2006. So even if, uh, like, it really can run on anything. Like, it's not a resource-intensive game either. Um, obviously, on my, like, 2006 laptop, I was playing on, like, really low settings and stuff. Um, but it was still ran perfectly fine on my old laptop. Uh, still does run, run fine on my old laptop. Sometimes if there's an event going and I uh, am headed out of town, I'll bring that laptop because it does still run, fortunately. Um, but, uh, oh, for sure, you'll you'll be able to run this game super smoothly. Any, any modern gaming laptop will play this game perfectly. Um, whether the game will run perfectly because of the servers and that sort of stuff, that's another question. But as far as being able to run the game, uh, there, I would be, it would blow my mind if you have a, had a gaming laptop that could not play this game. But, uh, and I just went control delete by mistake, which is why my game is lagging out. There we go. Um, yeah, it's a fun game to get into, and, uh, uh, and July is going to be the perfect time to get into it, if you get your laptop by that time, because uh, the event that they're putting on lets you make a character that gets up to level 250, which is where most of the, like, the heavy grind starts to happen, but it's also the level where, like, you start being able to really get into the dregs of the game like facing all but like three bosses in the game if you're level 250 you can face all but three bosses in the game um so 250 is is really it used to be end game like the the uh old maximum level used to be 250 so uh and for quite a while it was 250 so there's not a lot of uh, there's a lot of pre-250 content, but not a whole lot of post-250 content. Um, and so you can, uh, it's a, they call it a burning event, but it's basically a special event uh, where you can get, for every level you get, you actually get three levels. So you can uh, basically power level to 250 a lot easier. So if you are a new player interested in getting into this game, uh, it's much going to be much easier come July or whenever the event is coming in. 
maybe mid to late June or early July. I'm not sure. But yeah, you get a free character to level 250, essentially. I say free. Again, you have to still put in the grind time to get it to 250. Um, but it's much more achievable uh, and easier to, to get to than if you uh, play it without a burning event. Uh, who else am I going? I'm going to run Arcarium. I don't need to really, but I will. Uh, we'll turn off pet loot for this because I don't want... I only want if it drops a uh, Primal Essence. see a primal I see no primal so we'll take this 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 and the stuff in the corner here we'll be more selective about the stuff we get because most of it's worthless worth nothing to me yeah if you get your laptop by uh, June or July uh, I highly recommend this game I just recommend this game in general like, despite all the crap, I will give this game for, you know, like, the servers can be unstable. And I feel that's, but I feel that's every player of any MMORPG is they always have complaints about their game. Because, like, no MMORPG is ever going to be perfect. It's never going to be, you know, exactly what their player base wants. But, you know, people try their best. And they give you what you have. Fight Bean, my favorite boss. But yeah, a pretty easy game. I've been playing Maple Story, like, not on Reboot, because Reboot wasn't around, but I've been playing Maple Story since really it came out in, like, 2005. Um, so I also know, like, this game, like, the back of my hand. I've seen it grow. I've grown as it's grown. It's been changed. Now, I haven't played consistently that whole time by any means. Like, I took off, like, I didn't play the game for, like, four years at some point. Probably, like, from 2009 to 2012, I did not play this game. Um, but I picked it back up, and I keep going back to it because it's just fun. Japanese colors. Good luck. Uh, if you learn the color blue, uh, blue is for sadness. My English professor, professor, my English professor taught me that. So, if somebody teaches you blue, it means they're sad. Maybe give them a helping hand. Anything blue is sadness. Blue is an O. No, blue is a color, not an O. Got him. <laughs> I'm very funny. Uh, Cygnus Lotus. And a Kichi. We'll do a Kichi. A Kichi Mitsuhide. Or a Kechi. One of the two. Most people call it a kechi. I call it a kichi. It's most likely a kichi. But, uh, you know, I say what I say is correct um, as a general rule. Because it's easier than being wrong, is if I just say what I say is correct. It just makes me uh, not wrong about things, and that's just preferable to me. I like, uh, I like being right. It's better than being wrong, so uh, I just decided at one point that what I say is correct uh, at all times. Um, 
And I'm going to stand by that, you know? Only remember eight? Are the important ones, are they like, you know, do you remember your primaries? Whoops. Forgot that was there. Bye. That's the important thing. What is it? Red, blue, yellow are the main ones you need to know. And then everything else is just a, uh, like a like combination of those. Red, green, and yellow. Is there, No, it's red, blue, and yellow. Yeah, red, blue, and yellow. And then every other color is just uh, a combination of those. So as long as you know those three, you know every color. Fair. It is getting late uh, here for me, too. I might call it another early night. I mean, it's not super early. I've been going almost two hours. Um, there, there's some meso for the bank. Make up for our pitiful less than one bill in there. Bring it up to two bill. I was going to say, I'll put more in there. Uh, or I will take more out and blow up a shoulder. But I'm not going to blow up my shoulder yet. We'll save it for an event. We'll blow up our shoulder. Again. But I think, you know what? That's a good spot uh, to call it for the night. Um, I'm going to watch a show while I grind some meso. Yeah, no, I'm calling it night too. All right, y'all have a good night. Thank you for joining everyone who joined and new followers as well. I look forward to seeing you, and you all enjoy the rest of your night. Bye-bye.